Good morning, everybody, and uh, welcome back for another week. I hope you had a lovely weekend. Uh, I most certainly did, and um, especially because on Saturday morning, I went out for breakfast with my teenage daughter and three of her friends. And we sat for a good hour and a half and had a good chat about all sorts of things. I wonder if you've ever considered how much your parents enjoy sitting down with you and just hearing just your opinions on things, uh, especially if you're in year seven and eight and maybe communicating with your parents isn't as much fun as uh, you think it is. Still, something to think about. Right, today I want to talk about uh, playtimes and uh, how we go about that. And so for that, I brought Zephy out this morning and so she's going to do exactly what she loves doing, which is, of course, just playing with the ball. And all she does is I throw the ball. Let's do it again. I throw the ball and she, she, without, she gives it back to me. I throw the ball without thinking. She just rushes around and collects the ball. Now, that's fine. Now, I'm very happy for you to enjoy your playground and to race around and to do what you wish to. But sometimes you have to think more. Let's have a look at Zephy. Zephy, finish. Sit. Sit. Stay. Stay there. Stay. Go on. So, as you can see, sometimes Zephy also has to think more about her play. Finish. Sit. Stay. Stay there. Stay. Go on. So what I'm saying to you is, yes, chase about when you're playing, but also sometimes you just have to show that bit of restraint to make sure you don't run into somebody, you're not too aggressive. Um, I watched Year 8 playing some touch rugby recently. It was brilliant. Why was it brilliant? Well, they all understood the rules and they all played to the rules. Funnily enough, they had a really good game. One more thing about playtime, and that is, it's going to be, I think it's going to get a bit wetter later this week. We haven't had one yet, but very sooner or later, we're going to have a wet break. And I'm saying to you all, you've got to think even more about what you do and what you say at break time. Remember, one of our major things, strengths and qualities, which we want to consider in this term is kindness. And being thoughtful at break time, whether you're running around in the playground, whether you're playing your sport, or whether you're sitting in a classroom because it's work break and you're talking to each other, is kindness. If you know you're being kind, well, you can't go wrong. Thank you.